Yo, what's going on everybody? This is More Power here. Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you guys are having a powerful day and today what we're going to be doing is something a little bit different on the channel. We're going to be doing a versus video. We're going to take um, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 and we're going to pick one gun um, from uh, the, ver the launch of the game versus one DLC supply drop weapon and we're going to pit the two against each other and see which one is better. And uh, in today's docket, we're going to be chat using the VMP versus the HLX-4, both submachine guns, both very, very high fire rates, very high damage, and uh, let's see who wins. You, you got to watch the video to find out, so let's go ahead and get on into it. All right, VMP. Oh, and it's starting out. All right, good. So we're starting out at the very beginning. And we have the cosmic camo on. So we're going to try to go around the back here, sneak around the back. Got one kill. Got two. All right, so where'd he go? Ooh, okay. All right, we need to... Where'd he go? Oh my goodness, and I'm getting killed with the, the gun I'm supposed to be doing really well with. There we go. Hostile UAV above. Alright. Throw that nade over there. Even though I shouldn't really be using grenades. I should be reloading. Be advised. Hostile UAV is coming. Ooh. Slice and diced. He's probably jumped up here. Nope. Okay. So, what I like about the VMP is it is a really reliable uh, SMG. It uh, kills pretty fast. Um, doesn't take as many bullets to kill as a normal... As any other SMG would. I'm, and I'm trying... Well, no, he's using the same gun I am. I just... I don't understand. Alright. Ooh. Got him. That was actually a really perfectly thrown grenade. So we're going to minus one for that grenade kill. 7 and 12. Not terrible. But not really that good either. Oh, and that was a gun uh, that we did in a video uh, a couple of days ago. Ooh. And I just got blown out of my butthole. There we go. What I like is it can melt at ranges, and it's just reliable. You need a go-to gun, VMP. That's all I gotta. That's all I'm gonna tell you. I would suggest. There we go. There we go. Oh shoot. Woo. Oh man, that would have been a nice three piece. So we got 13 kills so far with it. Oh no, we have the kinetic armor. The steel breastplate of oh, death. Um. Ooh. And then he just phased through us. 
like the reverse flash. There we go. Let's get some health back. Oh, okay. Okay, so we're gonna be on a redwood and we're gonna be using the HLX. We put the cosmic camo on this one too. And we're not gonna use a uh Oh no, it's gotta rechamber. I forgot that this gun has to rechamber. Ooh. And uh 14 kills is the, the number to beat. Actually I will say 13 because we got that uh nade kill, but the HLX is, um, it's actually really solid pay to win or DLC weapon. I'm going to stop calling it pay to win, but DLC weapon. Okay. So there's our first death starting out kind of like we did the last game. We got a couple good kills and then, uh, you know, an untimely death. Please don't steal my kill. There we go. Okay, good. We didn't use our... I started to use my overdrive, but I stopped. So we're 3 and 2, so we need 10 more kills to tie. And 14 is the number that we need. Hear these guys. There we go. I gotta stop reloading as much. I just gotta start reloading when it gets to the point where I'm running out of bullets. Okay, so we were doing pretty good control in this area back here. And we got a guy just, just chilling, playing hide and seek. Oh, shoot. Where'd he go? Where's he at? Alright, so we wasted our overdrive. But we're actually not doing as bad. We're 6 and 2. Oh, 6 and 3. Just as I just as I say that, I jinx it. Ooh, okay. We're gonna follow him. Following an enemy, chasing after an enemy never really pays off. Or in this case, it actually does. Ranking up our HLX. That does count as a kill, even though it was a melee. That guy just got melted. All right. Oh, if I didn't run out of ammo there, I would have gotten him. Nine and four. We're going to stop trying to worry about how much kills we have until after we win the game. Ooh, nice little uh, wall bang there. Okay. Ooh, this gun actually, I think it kills faster than the uh, VMP, which this is a great comparison. I started to do the comparison, where'd he go? With the uh, nail gun, but I quickly changed my mind. When I remembered I have the HLX unlocked. And there's a lot of guys out back here just camping out the back. I guess they're just trying to snipe. But we put the same attachments on. Um, I would go as far as to say that this would be a dependable weapon too if you own it. Or if you happen to pick it up on the ground. This is a dependable weapon to use. The reason why I'm putting these two together is... Um, or comparing the two is because they're similar weapons. Now, the HLX does have some quirks to it that the 
uh, the MP doesn't, like it has to rechamber every time you stop firing, or the fact that, um, okay, he's over here somewhere, yep, there he is, free, free target, free target, oh, and he was sitting right there, okay, what, no, 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 and he just, That was a choke. I just straight up choked that one. But, um, they have similar fire rates. Uh, I would like to say similar damage. But, I think this one may have more damage. And then I die from the... From that. Okay, so we're gonna go back over this way. Because I think this is where we're finding our most success at. I think this is usually where everybody likes to hide. Alright. Try to round this out. We're down by 12 kills, I believe. Yeah. Be advised. Hostile gun. No. Uh, this gun, I think it has a little bit higher, longer range. Um, I'll give my opinions at the very end of the video of what gun I would recommend. Kill. There we go. He's over here. I can hear him. I've, uh, as you can tell, I have Astros, and I just absolutely got wrecked. But we went 18 and 15, uh, and I think we got 14 kills in the last one. So not too terribly different in terms of uh, KD, but the HLX did come out on top. Um,. If I had to recommend a weapon for you guys to use, I would I would either recommend either one. It just depends upon which ones you like. That's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed, leave a like. Let me know in the comment section um, other uh, games that you would like to see me do comparisons on. Um, and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And as always, guys, we'll catch y'all on the next video.